Thank you, Chris dead. Griffin, ultimate the pilot in the built. entire galaxy. Let's hit the camp once those towers are offline. Joke around. All right, you got it. Why did we climb out of the Mako just to call my son? Like, he's, he's gonna be fine. We could have done this from the tank. In fact, it's way better from the tank. Look, wildlife! Cool, the ocean is a completely different color than this fucking shoreline or whatever, but whatever, let's not question it. 2007, remasters can't fix everything. Look at these adorable little guys. It's like walking tables. Man, I can't wait till humanity enslaves you. What a novelty that would be. Who needs Roombas when you've got these fucks? You'll suck up my trash, won't you, my friend? Amongst many other things, hopefully. I know, I don't want to push my luck. Not every alien race in this game wants to have sex with you. And I don't necessarily want to have sex with them. The Cram people, sure, obviously, how could you ever resist? But the Batarians, absolutely fucking not. Go away, too many eyes. It's like banging a spider. And Shellob is the only acceptable candidate for that fucking role. Oh my god, I'm, <laughs> I'm genuine, I'm desperately trying to avoid running over these guys. Why do I care? They don't matter, they don't fucking mean anything. The game isn't even gonna notice. There's no fucking bad boy points coming out of that one. Jesus, you died that easily? I, Bring Down the Sky was the only vaguely challenging Mako thing. And I imagine in Mass Effect 1, this shit was bo- I thought you were a crab, but you're trying to kill me. Mass Effect 1, like all the fucking Mako missions were almost impossible in the original. And yet here, it's just... That is enough to bring down a fucking rocket drone. Some of the scariest shit imaginable on foot. On the highest difficulty in the game. And, and they don't do any fucking damage to me. Why? Were people actually powerful enough to block my fucking... Combat scanner? That's rare. Okay, I mean, you're still pathetic. You still die in one hit. But congratulations, I guess. You did, like, one thing right. Out of the thousands of things, you're doing very, very wrong. I'm only down to half shields and I've just been sitting here. I didn't move for a good, like, five minutes. Taking in the sights and also the missiles into my anus. No! Crab boy! I liked him! He was my favorite one of all! I stared at him for, like, four seconds longer than all the others. I thought we really had something! Until I blasted his fucking face to pieces. Oh god, I'm a bad, bad, bad person. Alright, let's see where the fuck we're going. We made our way to the gatehouse already. And at this point, I'm probably just gonna run down everything in my fucking sight. I'm willing to kill all the Geth. Why not take out these guys? I don't think these guys have nearly as much feeling as the Geth, and the Geth are fucking robots. Plus, if those things were to ever rise up, if those things ever get intelligent, and they start building fucking spaceships, humanity is out of the council, or like, the Citadel immediately. I'd much rather ally with the crab people than I would with us fleshy pricks. We're just the walking limp dicks of the galaxy. And it really fucking shows. Imagine if this game was just Shepard. Imagine I wouldn't have been able to get through the first fucking mission. We'd be here on like our eighth stream, like six at 60 hours into the fucking game. And Eden Prime would still just be a wreck. Oh, that was a sniper! <laughs> I kinda just stared him down! That wasn't a good idea! I don't need to be here at all, but at the same time... Oh, fuck! Oh, no! I forgot to sell my shit! We have, like, 13 spaces on one of the final missions of the game! Oh, fuck! Okay, one thing I did forget to do, though. We need to give Liara brain damage! Enjoy being a savant go- wait, 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 no, it's a tech thing. I don't need to give Liara brain damage, I was meant for Tali. Your brain can remain intact. For now. Ah. Uh, you're fine as you are, blue eyes a piece of shit, but at the same time, I don't know why you even have tech abilities. Can I upgrade you from Polaris? You're already using Polaris, that's a Polaris 9. Got a whole extra one point. How exciting. Congratulations, it's useless. What am I meant to do? AI is a thousand times better than I could ever fucking be. I had no idea what the hell was going on. All right, what the fuck can we do with this? <laughs> Just go directly through the fucking first place it puts me. Easy. I don't want any of this. Crossfire is terrible. Uh, Inferno round. I mean, it's level ten. That might be the first instance of that. 
every single container we open now. So spending less than a second at them, we have to actually give it some thought. I fucking hate it, man. I'll go through and mark some stuff as trash soon. And then just convert it all to gel at once. I, I'd love to sell it. It makes more sense to sell it. Since I think every item, no matter how useless, converts into the same amount of Omni-Gel. Like a level 1 of fucking, uh, like, blue wire tool or whatever will give the exact same fucking amount. Go away! The exact same amount as, like, the ultimate gun in the game. I don't even really need to kill you, thinking about it. You've done no damage! I've been in front of you for this much time. I ripped your shields apart entirely and bonked you to the fucking floor and you did nothing to me. You haven't even stubbed my fucking trucks. To I'm probably doing more damage to myself mounting you than you could ever fucking do to me. Holy shit! Okay, that was impressive. You proved me wrong. I mean, you more threw yourself into the fucking sky, but I mean... I definitely went over like a speed bump. Oh boy, how scary. Jeez, what's the point in you? These things used to be genuinely terrifying. I mean, they weren't, because you could just run them the fuck over. And it's beautiful. Watching something with so many legs ragdoll might be the most satisfying thing that humanity has ever done for itself. Congratulations, humanity. We have peaked. We're done. We don't need to evolve any further. There you go! I'm surely I'm gonna level up soon. We've done so many- we've done so many fucking missions in the Mako now. The amount of turrets I had to blast down on, uh, X-57 alone, and I've just still got nothing? The other way seems to just be a dead end, so I'm gonna go there first. You guys know how much I love doing everything wrong that I possibly can. Let's go, uh, as far into the distance. Let's just ride off into the sunset. We don't need to save the world. Saving the world's boring. Let's just retire. I mean, we haven't quite got uh, the girl of our dreams just yet. Tali is still just completely incapable. She needs time to warm up to it. I don't think she's ever seen a human before before me. She probably finds me repulsive. And who can blame her? Wait, this is the right way as well? This just doesn't exist on the map, but okay. That's not what dead ends are supposed to be, game. Dead ends are supposed to be dead. And also ends. <laughs> what? Okay, you know what? They probably weren't intimidating at all in Mass Effect 1 either. Because you can just try to fuck them. I really want to see the offspring between the Mako and these things. Like, if we ever needed to destroy the Geth, the Geth, let's just make love to the Geth, produce new Geth of our fucking own, because they'll have Mako blood, and the Mako will do anything I fucking desire. My favorite son. Really gonna take the family business to new levels. The family business of just sodomizing robot aliens. Makes a killing. So much fucking money in that. We're the industry leaders. No one does it like us. My thrusting power is unmatchable. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> the only damage they can do to us is also at cost of them even being able to stand up for like 10 full minutes. We still barely do any damage to them. Like, it's, it's so slow. This is probably the biggest Geth Colossus we've ever seen too, because he's just not dying. We're barely even doing chip damage. Even, I think he might be healing. I think we're going against the great- Oh, and I'm about to overheat. That's a bad idea. Knock him down so he can't fucking heal. How are you healing though? Like, surely I'm just blasting pieces off of you. It's not like you can just inhale drugs at any given fucking moment and then everything is fine. That's an exclusively human skill, damn it. We're so good at it. Ah, the perks of being a disaster. They just... I don't understand how, like, me going at one mile an hour, me nudging them with my fucking... <laughs> my cute little headlights. This going towards you, that's probably the least intimidating thing imaginable. Fucking Brum from the hit TV show Brum would be a much more scary fucking foe. Even the Mako coming at you at fucking mock speed compared to Brum like doing this, Brum still gets the fucking victory. Oh my god, someone mod that immediately. Nothing would make me happier in this entire goddamn world. I want to be the super cruising superhero. This is just... <laughs> 
One percent of Brits and no one else in the world understand whatever the fuck I'm saying. It's probably the worst ch like kids show of all fucking time, but I lived for it when I was like three. And you know what? I'm gonna add it as part of our like cult's daily worship. If you don't watch Brum, are you even worthy? I haven't seen it since I was like two. I don't, I don't even really know what it is. I just remember his horrifying fucking face. Any like British kids show, produ it's all nightmare fuel. Go back to it now and it's like, what the fuck? What? How was I not disturbed? Is this why I've accomplished nothing in my life? Because this still haunts my dreams. And every night I just block it the fuck out. Does Brum come to me in the night? Whisper me sweet nothings and also gross everythings. What's the opposite of sweet? Sour. Sour everything? I hate myself. Let's go. I was stuck directly on his kneecap. You're only a sniper. He didn't just- What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a destroyer? I'm dead. I might last for like another fucking second. I think he's going for Garrus, because he was very much within fucking fisting range, and I'm just fine. Yeah, he doesn't want anything to do with me. How dare you try and fist my boy! He's all mine! What is that? What's just... I think the box is trying to shoot me down. Oh no, it's just a Geth- is that what Geth Destroyers actually shoot like? No, they have shotguns. I've never seen a Geth Destroyer do anything other than try to bonk me, so I don't really know what the fuck was happening. Maybe it's Liara's stupid pistol, but that's a pistol, it doesn't fire that fucking fast. Now the box was just trying to piss on me on the way past, and you know what? Good for you, dude. If I could say that I'd pissed on the dude that saved the fucking world, like what a fucking claim to fame. Goodbye Lancer, you're the worst thing in the game. Uh, I will take the suckle up. Anything that sounds Russian is guaranteed to be just the ultimate. Ooh. Akat gun power controls. Goodbye. And that's what levels me up. Why does the Normandy get to land again? Ah, uh, I think it's because I can trade out people uh, at fucking will on Vermeil. Not at will, but as long as I go back to like our main hub or whatever. I don't have to go back to the Normandy to do it because I don't think we're allowed off planet for quite some time. It's not a very big planet, but it's a very intense everything is falling apart kind of planet. And I'm very, very excited. Oh, crate. No, but you're going to fill my bottomless hole to the brim. Explorer armor. The thunder's not great. It was great and now it's bad. I think that was heavy armor. So no one. <laughs> Look at all this stuff. Can I mark it as trash? No, we gotta do it one by fucking one. Ow. This is painful. What horrible design is this? What would have been a much better choice is like you're able to carry it, but when you're about to go off world, it doesn't make sense because if you're about to go off world, I mean, you could just store it on the Normandy. When you're about to go off world, um, that's when you have to choose, you know, what you break down, what you sell, or whatever the fuck. Like, you have the option to do it then, because having to do it, breaking up the action to this fucking extent. Like, I've killed so many geth. We have so much to break down into nothing but spunk. 88 Omnigel. You get four Omnigel per each thing. So that means I just broke down 22 items. Agony. Can me doing math? Can we do a math live? Jesus, I mean, it took me quite a while to do it. I was masking it with endless fucking rambles. But man, I aced man. Like I was actually pretty good at school. I never studied once in my fucking life because studying make my brain hurt very, very badly. But I like, I did pretty good. And I think I, I got like a, I think I, I, I got an A in like general math and now I can't even times things. It took me a while to divide 88 by four. <laughs> what happened to me? What is the British schooling system? This is why I dropped out of college. There's a big fucking moment coming up and I'm gonna turn up dialogue for that. As it's one of my favorite things in the entirety of the series. Jesus, that was incredible. Why don't I use lift more? Using, uh, using lift and then the sniper? Does throw's job thousands of times better than throw ever? Cause that's not how ice works, by the way. What the fuck was that? 
who called in a fucking thaumaturge. That doesn't exist in this game. Uh, Prodigy... Yeah, I probably do need those. No, 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 no. Prodigy isn't good. Prodigy fucking sucks. I'm not... <laughs> ah! No, that's a pulse rifle! Shit! That's really good! That's probably the best assault rifle we've found so far, and I don't have space for it! Oh my god, I have sinned! Uh, let's go back. We've probably got some terrible pistols. Strikers are bad. All these pistols become nothing before my eyes, so we never miss out on any of those ever again. I'm still out is actually better than what I've got to an extent. The razor, though? Oh, the razor's also nice. I haven't upgraded my pistol in a while. I think it's the Raikou that's trapped. Yeah, the Raikou sucks. Kessler? Kessler is awful. What the fuck? Look at that difference in DP. Maybe it's good for a specific reason, but I feel like a lot, a, a lot of weapons I'll just never give a try because their stats look terrible, but might be amazing in other ways. There's a lot of weapons in the Mass Effect series uh, kind of have their very own unique, uh, like unique abilities, but honestly, that much of a fucking uh, not depravity. I've said this word before. Disparity. There we go. <laughs> I've said this word before as my justification for like, don't worry guys, I'm not completely fucking stupid. Um, but yeah, and there's such a disparity between what I'm using that is pretty ancient and a lower rank than it anyway, and, uh, and this piece of shit, I don't really trust it to be even slightly fucking worth it. Sorry about all the menus that we're in right now, I will get out of it as soon as I fucking can, I just need some space. I'm not throwing away, like, Geth Arsenal anymore. That's the first time we fucking had access to that, which is insanity. That's a lot of fucking gel. The Mako will never ever suffer again. I'm gonna keep the brawler because I quite like it. I'm not willing to- But the Karpov! It's Russian! It's bound to be amazing! What have you got? You got the Brawler 8, I can give you a Brawler 9. That way you don't really have to change anything. I'm gonna stick with the Cryo Rounds. I think, uh... Having like different types of rounds, like the poison rounds, the cryo rounds, and the heat rounds. I think it works a lot better when it's on your friends, as opposed to putting it on your own guns, because that doesn't- you don't have to sacrifice, like, an actually half-decent- fuck, I, th I think I'm using something stupid. Yeah, I'm using proton rounds on that, but whatever. You don't have to, um, sacrifice a really, really good at upgrade there, just for sort of, like, unique elemental effects. But combining the elemental effects with the upgrades that you then have is pretty fucking great. I say having two combat scanners on the pistol, because I just know I'm never gonna use it. That's a Geth Destroyer with a goddamn rocket launcher! Who the fuck allowed that? No, you're getting thrown immediately! Actually, that's probably a bad idea. He'll just start using the rocket launcher again. I'm pretty sure his fists are probably preferable here. Garrus, you're never allowed to use the assault rifle. Why do you keep trying? Put it away! Why do you even own one? You absolute slut. Stick- choose one weapon and stick with it. He's gonna get jealous. Speaking of which, how long has it been since I've upgraded Garrus's fucking sniper? <laughs> it's been a long time to the point where even the striker is better. That's embarrassing, dude. Uh, equalizers are good, but they're not Russian. The Volkov is what we're looking for. Actually, that's the same as what I have, and I just- I fucked up! <laughs> I'm gonna have to put everything back on it! I think the Re no, the Reaper's trash, the Punisher is trash, the Naganado with a name like that is also awful. Um, I mean the Volkov is only good because it fires as fast as it does. I want Garrus to have high impact all the fucking time. It's got the Avenger and it's just shit. I'm gonna give him the Harpoon. Cause that way his assassinations will hit like, ex like a fucking assassinations. Uh, Snowblind, lowers rate of fire, it doesn't matter, I think that's a one shot gun. Frictionless materials. He's gonna be so fucking damp, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna give him a kinetic coil as well. Alright, Garrus looking fucking good. Colossus armor! Holy fuck, that's good! That's better than Phantom, and it's rare that we see something like that. It's immediately put on his helmet? Oh no, he already had the helmet on, but it was like the hairnet helmet that looks fucking terrible. Uh, I mean, I'm not saying that looks any better. Honestly, that looks far fucking worse, but it's all black. I'm just gonna take off his helmet and pretend that it doesn't exist. Um... Logic Rest is what I meant to give you. Yeah, okay. We're, we're all pretty set up here. I could probably upgrade Garrus' Assault Rifle. He's using a Breaker 7. We have a Kovalayov. Look at that fucking thing! Oh my god! 
What am I using? I'm using a Kovalev. Yeah, it's it's pretty fucking good. Yeah, you, Garrus is probably best suited to single fire weapons. Uh, I'm just saying that because he's the fucking sniper man. It's not going to make a difference at all. I don't know. I just kind of like um, consistency between my boys. I like giving them things that make sense. Which is why I give Liara absolutely nothing and just hope she uses her biotics all the time. What? How the hell do I even get down? Why is there no vaulting in this game? In Mass Effect 3, the movement actually gets really fucking good and really slick. And in Mass Effect Andromeda, as much as it's an absolute sin to say, it's got my favorite movement in any fucking uh, like third-person action game ever. It's amazing. Honestly, the combat in Andromeda is really really good even if the encounters suck like the uh, the systems that are there are absolutely fucking stunning the way you can combine fucking abilities as well amazing it's just the you know every other aspect of that game is well i i'm pretty sure the word andromeda has replaced the word dog shit at this point ah we're nearly there man i quite like this i'm enjoying the gauntlet of, uh, the, of um just charging down this beautiful beautiful landscape I'd love to see what people are doing with the photo mode. I haven't done a whole lot of fucking with it just yet. What's going on, Joker? And why does Joker get to refer- Like, surely he hasn't been able to talk to anyone. This man can't walk. Stay with the fucking Normandy. Get anyone else to tell me what's going on. Send out Rex. He's clearly our best negotiator. Because I think your, uh... Point of negotiation kind of drops a little bit. When <laughs> the sight of a man instantly makes you defecate. Uh, hello? Please fucking move?